to New York now, where a teenager targeted in an apparent random attack in broad daylight. Surveillance footage shows her going inside this juice bar when that stranger walks up and stabs her. As Kieran Dillon with our New York City station reports, authorities are now on the hunt for that suspect. Some guy who saw me in that his randomness, he just wanted to come and hurt me. Dejean Wilson remains in shock. The 16-year-old was heading into this juice bar in Brownsville on May 22nd when a man approached her from behind. Surveillance video catches the moment he pulled out a knife and stabbed her in the left shoulder. It felt like a punch. It hurt, but, you know, I was already getting something, so I didn't want to cause any drama, so I just left it behind. Wilson says she didn't realize she'd been stabbed until two men from the neighborhood approached her to help. They walked her home, where her mother was horrified to learn about what had happened. Well, I took a closer look. I took it and I opened it, and it was a deep wound. And I was like, oh, no, it looked like you were stabbed. And when I said that, that's when she started freaking out. She started crying. Wilson was rushed to the hospital where she was treated and released. Her mother says her daughter has remained strong through the process. Oh, she is a trooper. She's a soldier. She's a great kid. As for Wilson, she has no idea why she was targeted. I don't know them. I was just going to the store and it was broad daylight outside. Well, I don't understand why they would do that. Meantime, police have identified the suspect as 20-year-old Louis O.C. They are asking for help in finding him. Wilson hopes anyone who knows anything will come forward. It's nice that they're still trying to look for him like this. And I hope for the people that they just stay safe from people like him. We're glad she's okay. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.